On Tuesday the 13th of September, Kenya will have a new administration when His Excellency the Deputy President William Ruto officially takes over the government. Several people have already started saying that he is likely to fire some of the top allies of His Excellency the Head of State President Uhuru Kenyatta when he takes over power. Inasmuch as that is factual, some of the top government officials are protected by the constitution and there the deputy president who is incoming head of state will not have powers to fire them. Among them is the National Intelligence Service Director Philip K. Mayu whose term in office is normally protected by the constitution unless he decides to step down from the top position. The Inspector General of the National Police Service is also protected by the Constitution and the incoming head of there will have have powers to fire or sack him. Others are Chief Justice Martha Coombe who enjoys a well-protected tenure of office, the Director of Public Prosecutions Mr. Nor Audin Haji as well as the Director of Criminal Investigations Mr. George Kinotai. The Star newspaper confirms, constitutionally, the NIS director is protected by the constitution just like Chief Justice Martha Coombe, Director of Public Prosecution Nor Auden Haji, Director of Criminal Investigations George Kenotai, Inspector General of Police Hilary Mutyambi and Central Bank of Kenya Governor Patrick Njeroj, 